back to another video on my channel and in today's video I'm going to be unboxing NCT's Glitch Mode. I did pick this up from So Collab and I also got a pre-order poster which I will leave a photo of at the end of the video. But I'm super excited so let's get right into it. So I kept it in the packet because I only got it yesterday. But let's see if we can take it out. I'll probably edit this bit out. <laughs> So here is the photo book, I did just take it out of the packet, it was a bit of a struggle so I did it off camera. But here is the front, and the back, and the side. Super cute. And it does come with the CD plate, so I guess we can look at that first. Here is the CD. You can see me, I don't want to be seen. Super pretty, it says glitch mode, just in a packet, and then you just take it out of the packet. If it wants to come out, it's a bit stuck. But yeah, super cute. It's quite a thick CD. Gosh, that's so thick. Here is the CD plate. Super pretty. I'm really excited for this unboxing. I think this is the first proper NCT Dream unboxing I've done on my channel. If you don't know, I click Chonla, so I'm very excited to open this. But let's go through the photo book. I'm just going to move that CD out of the way. So here is the photo book. Oh, all the inclusions. Oh my gosh, I completely forgot about those. Let's take those out. Yeah. Don't want to see my inclusions, but we can go through the photo book. So let's have a little look. Super pretty. So we have Mock and Jenna. Chonla. I absolutely love his little pink uh, tips in his hair. I think it's super pretty. We have Renjun. And we have Jisung and Jimin. They're all very handsome. And then we have Hei Chan and Jimin. I have Mark and Renjun. And Jisung and Jimin. And Renjun and Jimin. And Jeno. Jisung and Chonla. This photo book is very pretty. I love this concept. It's very nice. The pages are quite thick, so I don't know if I'm missing photos. Yeah, I love how fun and bright this concept is. It's very nice. It's been a while since Dream have had a comeback, but I absolutely love it from start to finish. I'll go through the track list a little bit later. It's very nice. I love this photo of Chonma. Very, very pretty. I honestly love this comeback. I think Glitch Mode is a very good song. I really enjoyed it. Wow, this just this whole photo shoot. Ugh. This whole photo shoot is very fun. I like it. This comeback was very different from um, Hello Future, and yet it's kind of similar. If that makes sense, like the vibe. I absolutely love it. Second full length album though, that's crazy to me. But yeah, it's very exciting. I wonder if they'll do a repackage like they did for Hot Sauce when they released Hello Future. I wonder if they'll do that again. The photos are very pretty. Here are the songs. So, yeah. My favourite song is Teddy Bear. And then I also really like Drive. Replay is pretty good. Arcade's really good. Rewind's really good. Did I already say that? I might have done. Um, and obviously Glitch Mode is amazing. Here we have the lyrics. This is very um, colourful. I love the different typographies that they've used. Very nice. There was one track and it reminded me of like lo-fi kind of. <laughs> if you get what I mean, like the vibe of it. Very cool. I love this album from start to finish. It's just a fun album. I don't know if it's my favourite dream album. I think um, Hello Future and Hot Sauce are still my favourite, but honestly, you can't skip a dream a song at all. They're like so good. I literally can't skip any. Such a good album. It gets kind of hard when you get to the back of the photo book to like show the photos. I feel like I missed a page there, but. I guess I didn't. 
I also think there was loads of photos of Chonla in this photo book, which is kind of sad. Here's the credits, and there is the back. That was quite a quick flip through, but I think the photo book was very pretty. It's a little smaller, I think, than the Hello Future one. It's a little smaller, I think, than the Hello Future one, but at least it's not like a magazine thickness, if that makes sense. Like, I feel like the Hello Future one was kind of like a magazine. At least this one has like a proper spine. But yeah, very pretty. So that was the photo book. We've already looked at the CD, so I'll put that there as well. Let's take a look at the inclusions. So like I said, I will include my um, poster at the end, but it looks like it came with a little folded poster. So here is what that looks like. I'm going to do it this way so it gets on the camera. But it says glitch mode and it has all the numbers on it. Very pretty. I might include a photo of that as well. And then we have all of the like thanks to's on the back. Wow, Jamin wrote the smallest thanks to. Oh, look at Mark's, it's massive. Massive thanks to. But yes, very nice. So I might hang this on my wall. I think it's very pretty. But we got a group poster. And then we got some random things which I'm going to flip over. Hopefully there's no signatures. Oh dear. Oh, wait, that looks like a booklet. Never mind. So we have some stickers. Very pretty. Not going to use these, but very pretty so you have some stickers and then oh, is there names on the box of these photo cards we have a little booklet so we have mark renjun jeno hichan jamin chonla excuse you sir <laughs> what is this oh wow and then we have jisung and then we have jisung chonla jamin hichan jeno renjun and mark Super nice. I think I'm going to leave this as the booklet, but I imagine you can um, rip them and put them as postcards. So that's very nice. I definitely, if I had multiple copies, would do that. And then let's look through the booklet first. So this is the SM flyer. We have just the regular. Uh, oh, I got one of these. Oh, how exciting. So I got one of the little tickets. Um... If you take these in to this address, you get a circle card. Super cute. I'm going to put this in my binder because obviously I don't live in Korea, so I can't enter that event. But it's probably shut by now anyway. When was the closing deadline? Oh, March. Uh, March, May. <laughs> You've got till May 29th to claim these. But obviously I don't live in Korea, so I would just keep that in my binder as a little um, extra, I guess. And then it is a personalised ad, so we have glitch mode. Is it just me who keeps their um, SM Town booklets? I always keep mine for some reason. Unless they're just the ones that just have this cover. Because they don't all have personalised. I found my um, Reload one the other day when I was clearing my room out. I found that quite funny. Um, this one has a signature, so I guess we can look at this one first. Three, two, one. <gasps> we got Hitchan! Super cute. I never pull Hitchan, I always pull Jisung, so that's really nice. Hichan is one of my biases, so that's very pretty. Although we all know I only collect Chonla for NCT because they're quite an expensive group to collect. And the other card we got is the Lenticular. Three, two, one. We got Hichan set! Super pretty. So here's what his little Lenticular looks like. Very nice. I really like that. So we got a nice Hichan set. That's really cool. I never pull much a chance, so that's really nice. Um, so yes, yeah, so let me put everything back into frame and we can film the outro. So that was it for my unboxing of NCT Dream's second full-length album, Glitch Mode. If you did like this video, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you are new and want to see more K-pop related content. But until next time, bye!